Greetings MacWaver, this is Offshore HSO and welcome back again to another MacWaver Online today and we're going to be taking a look at the Privana 2 so the difference between this and Privana 1 is that it has a lot of energy hard points on the Privana 2 so it basically it's the near uh, opposite of the Privana 1 and also I believe one of the favorite build I am disappointed at the Privana 3 because the Privana 3 has uh, less energy point but it's quite similar the only thing it has is energy from, uh, energy hard point so I won't be making a video on the Piranha 3 since it's too similar and probably Piranha 1 and 2 will be the only Piranha that I'll be using so this this the Piranha 2 it came with this camo with it so it looks really interesting it has that uh, how you say scales on it and I wish it had they they actually made a proper camo that gave the fish scales on the Pivana instead of anything else. Right. So without further ado, let's take a look at the loadout for this Mac. So I didn't really change it much. It has all the ER micro lasers that came with it. So right here, uh, we'll start off with the armor. The right and left arm has 13 armor, the right and left torso have 17. Uh, frontal and four rear armor. The head has 19 number. The center torso has 19 frontal armor, six rear armor. Both legs has about 17 armor. Uh, FF armor, uh, double heat sinks and endo steel as the upgrades. It has six double heat sinks. It has six ER micro lasers on the right torso. Same goes for the left torso. Uh, it has ER micro lasers again on the right and left arm each and another ER micro, la uh, micro lasers on the center torso. It comes with the uh, Clan XL engine at the, uh, 180 which is 5.5 tons which allows it to move at 145.8 km per hour and reverse at 97.1 km per hour because it's going to need this speed. Same goes for the Piranha 1. I can't, cannot max up the tonnage for some reason. There's nothing that has a 0 0.1. So I won't be filling that in. But the difference between this build and the build that I had on the uh, Piranha 1 is that, that it has armors in the arm. Because right? I can't actually spend much skill points on this tree as, as any other consumable. We have three cool shots and one advanced UAV. So we have fire, a total firepower is 16, I mean 36 uh, firepower that really isn't that much. Hit management is at 1, it's quite balanced. But uh, you gotta be careful, having this much micro lasers, I mean firing it all at once or firing it sequently too fast will actually blow up this mech. Just go boom, alpha shot. Never alpha shot on this mech, never. <laughs> so I've grouped up the weapons like so. So we have seven on weapon group one, and we have, uh, I believe, six, seven, eight, eight on weapon group uh, two. So it, it's it's gonna generate a lot of heat. Let's uh, look at the skill tree. Okay, like so, firepower skill tree get that uh, laser duration we're going to need it uh, get as much range as possible uh, get as much heat generation as possible so this is the skill tree that i place on this uh, avoid taking velocity or any other notes that it has no use to this mech survivability we needed a, f a few armor on this uh, I don't, I don't, I don't agree with anyone telling me that this does not require armor at all. So again, we go for the reinforced casing, all of it, and we go for the skeleton, uh, skeleton density, all of it, and take some of the armor hardening. We have no choice but to spend some skill points on the shock absorbent since we're going to be jumping off hills pretty quickly. So we need that shock absorbent as well. Nothing at mobility, nothing at jump jets. Since it doesn't have jump jets and operation we need that cool run and we need that heat contaminant to increase the heat threshold on this mag so i don't have any problem with gyro so i went for a hill climb instead uh, we don't actually need the quick ignition but uh, we have to go through it nonetheless 
we did not spend any on the sensors auxiliary we did not spend anything on the uav except for this part here which we had to go through i did not spend anything on the uh, uh, airstrike as well because we're not going to be using a lot of it so but we do we'll, we will be using some of the kill i mean the uh, cool shots on this mech because we really need them actually but there's a way without using them uh, unless you're actually brawling so we took the capture assist for because this is a fast mech probably want to be playing this on a conquest mode so that's my skill tree for this mech. I've done it pretty fast. It's pretty simple and pretty similar to what we had on the... No, actually, it isn't similar. The the one had sensors. Well, because it had ballistic on the Piranha 1, we didn't need to go for any of the heat contaminant or, the, or I mean, the heat threshold or the cool run. So we could spend more skill points on other other things that we needed, like the sensors. So if you ask me if I prefer between 1 and 2, I actually tell you now that I prefer uh, Mac Piranha number 1 because I could spend the skill points on any other things. Like, I did not have to spend a lot on, on the firepower skill tree. So, that's all I have for the build itself. Did I miss anything? I don't think so. Now let's take a look at some gameplays that we're going to play right after this one two or maybe three gameplays let's see how it goes okay everybody i'm in my battle mode right now <laughs> just having a little fun putting on the mask it makes me feel a little maybe weird or immersive at the same time <laughs> so we're in the ballot skirmish game mode Right here, but where are we going? Team kind of splitting up to the right here. Oh, don't want to be losing armor on the legs of the if, if I run into anybody. But I'm just going to go to the E6 area. See where the team is going at the same time. Looks like somebody spotted something over there, firing a large laser and PPC, trying to hit somebody. And as you know, this is really hot map, so it is a, going to be a good test of uh, the build here. Let's take a look at one shot. One shot is about twenty percent in this hot map, so it's it's okay. Fox six low ground, commandos running around. Fox six. Oh, don't run into me, man. That locust is pretty far. Fox 5 high ground, not here. Oh! oh. <laughs> that set almost fell off. Fox 4 four high. We gotta wait a little for all here to see when the brawling starts and that's when we come in so the way you play this now is to control the heat management firing a weapon group Very one and fine. two at a time New target try acquired. control your heat management oh man that's all lrms New target acquired. that guy earlier dire wolf What's that? Shots coming from somewhere. Oh, them there. Oh, good for us if we are at range. Gonna be standing next year. When the. What's that? Wow. We don't want to be out in open. Gotta remember that. Especially with that LRM there. When she's getting hurt pretty bad, lost 19%. There's an air strike. Also, guys, air strike. I'm not sure when this brawling is gonna start. We're gonna have to be very patient riding this mech. Oh. Target acquired. 
because everyone's keeping their distance. So. Let's see if I can join these guys up here. Up here then. Only way I can go up there if I go behind here. Go up the hill here. New target acquired. Oh, you can finish it off. Help. Target destroyed. New target acquired. Target spotted. Target spotted. I need help. Just the first. You gotta be careful with the same type of piranha build. See, that's how you fire your shots. Didn't need my help. So, can now we're basically winning. That's not enough. Uh oh, didn't want to drop that high. Target acquired. Play around with them. New target acquired. Two shot, turn around. Control our heat a bit. Not good for us, we gotta turn. Okay. That, that's how to fight that, that guy, you know, you got, you, got, you got to spread that machine gun damage. Not a really good game, first game we have. I uh, didn't get a lot of chance to assassinate anybody. Our frame rate is suffering for some reason. I got to check out what's wrong with that later. I expected more damage for the piranha though. Ballistics. It's probably this extra armor I'm wearing right now. <laughs> What's the last one? Love one. Echo 4. That's pretty far. Target acquired. Target spotted. He's pretty. Wow, he's fresh. Yeah. Probably reconnected. The enemy has started to chip away at We won't reach there in time. Target spotted. Target spotted. Oh. Good work. We didn't get there in time. <laughs> oh well, his back was already cord. Oh. I was not the core damage dealer to him. Oh, 200,000 CBLs, 2 kills, 1 most damage dealt, 5 components blown off, 1.5k XP. Not really well in the damage point here, but let's try a second game and let's see what the results is. Right. Uh, actually had a second game earlier but the lag was so bad I needed to restart my computer and now the frame rate is okay already although 50 frame rates well, it's good enough for recording and now I can play smoothly 
not like I had in my second game. I'm not gonna show the second game because the lag was so bad, the frame rate was so bad. Sorry, that uh, it, I, I'm, I'm not gonna show it. So this will be our official second game. This actually is the third game, but that's okay. Let's see what we can do here, and let's see what Dam damage we output we can do. I do do an average of 700 damage, 500, 700 damage with this mech. Just not having that uh, luck in the first game. Zoom in here. I think I just saw a light mech there, light mech. There's a light mech there. Oops. Arctic Cheetah. Yeah. Trying to get behind us. Yeah, there he is. What? How did that hit the front of my torso? <laughs> That's not right. <laughs> That's definitely not right. New target acquired. I didn't see anything hit the front. I don't think the leg's that bad. But my ping is going pretty 200 for some reason. Oi. Oh, there you go. Push it to 7 at 7. Okay. Let's get going. The battle is started. And we want to move in closer. The enemy is on the other side of the map already. Yes, they're spread, they have a firing line. Yeah. He has a happy laser, he's dangerous to us. This is a pretty cool map so we don't have to worry too much about thing going down cooldown doing so slowly got that dire wolf but our right torso is hurting oh marauder you blew off our component so wolf out. Oh, oh, where's the missile coming from? Kill. Awesome, it's there. We're gonna have to do some port cutting for a while. Bravo. Target spotted. Didn't think. Thought I was going that side. Target spotted. Warning incoming. New target acquired. Right. He's not turning. Oh, blow off, blow off his torso. I'm surprised he can hit me with the auto cannons. Watch out for Alpha Commando on our rear section. Craps down there. Left torso critical damage. Left arm critical damage. Left torso critical damage. Got a kill on that one. Oh. That crap's still pretty fresh. But he's overheated. Gonna override our heat. He dead? He's not dead yet? Second kill, most damage dealt. I'm gonna get this commando. Down a bit. 
Come on. He's good. Okay, there we go. Most damage dealt on him as well. Gonna want to go Target after acquired. this guy. We're gonna kill the Nova. And we're gonna kill this guy. Oh, we miss him. So, where's the last guy? Over here. There you go. He's an ER heavy life laser. He wouldn't do a lot of damage to us. Yeah. Another killing blow. <laughs> That's pretty good, I think. We have five kills to our name here. So we have 400,000 civils, uh, 694 damage, three more damage dealt, five killing blows, 13 components destroyed, 3000 XP. And we're the. Let's see, I'm in the entire game. We're the third most damage dealt, I believe. Oh, nearly 700. That's good, but we have 574 match, yeah, 572 match points, which is the highest among the game. Well, I think we have enough time for one more game. Alright, so we're in our third and final game of today. And it's uh, assault on the Alpines. Well, uh, I really hate this map in assault or in skirmish. It's not a map I like, but it's another cool map that gives us a bit of an advantage. But don't get me wrong, this map actually does well in a hot map as well. So because of Micro lasers does not generate as much heat as the ER small lasers. Mm. Don't like this, this blocking my right? side view. Side view. I mean. Affirmative. I don't see any of them. Thanks. Affirmative. I see no enemies. Oh, we should go up. Don't stay here. Probably going that side. Yeah, there they are. Everybody help. We gotta go in, go in. Yep, this is not a good place to be. This we is gotta take two of them. But this, they can just pop, pop. They're up there. there. We're gonna die here if we don't move up. More matches. Agree with you on that. This is fake cover. some help though. Oh, I gotta get out there. We're gonna have to start pop darting. We have no choice. A 
left. So we didn't make it in time. So it's facing us. Go. Go. Oh, we blew up the shoulder. Yep, we got an assault. That's gonna help us a lot. That piranha is not gonna be. Not very smart. New target acquired. Enemy base is being captured. Yeah, we got the This looks pretty good here. Target, that's a good target. Uh, he has no weapons. We got another kill. I won that kill. And we got last one. Last kill goes to us. Yeah, I thought we were gonna lose there. It's just that they didn't push us. Alright, for 400,000 C bills again. Uh, 600 damage is <laughs> basically 600 damage. Two more damage dealt. Three killing blows. Nine components is void. 3,000 XP. Let's see how well we did among our teammates and among the entire game. We are basically the third most damage dealt again. But again, we have the most uh, match scores at 521. So we 3 kills, 7 assists, which is pretty good. And I hope you enjoy the video guys and I hope you enjoy it. <laughs> Let me know what you think. I'm in battle mode right now. See you guys next time. I'll show out.